Red Crest, what does it mean to me? It's our championship. It's everything that you work for throughout the whole year wrapped up into one event. You know, last year we got close and man, I just, I mean, just added really more fuel to the fire to win this championship even more. So these first two days are, are very similar to a pole position type day. These are qualifying days to get into the final events. Basically, there's 40 anglers competing and only 20 who advance the actual three day leg of this tournament. And at the end of the day, there's only one person that can hold that trophy up at the end of this week. And that's all we're gunning for, to be that one guy. Thank you, I appreciate it. We're taking out with MDJ. Yeah. Okay. All right, y'all, top 20 advance on after these next two days. We have very important today to get a good bag and put us in a good position going into day two. Next time you are, Nicole? Is that Dada? He goes, Dada, -da. he did. Yeah. He goes, Dada. Yeah. Yeah. What's up, buddy? He's cold. My little koala bear. Yeah, it is cold. You a little chilly? Dada. -da. Chilly. He goes, Dada. -da. It's like a growl. It's not like a dad. Dada. -da. Da -da. Da -da. All right, you guys. Good. Welcome, everyone, to the 2023 Red Chris, presented by Shore Lunch. This is qualifying day number one. And here we go. He's a two time Jacob Wheeler! Let's go get him. Let's check in with Jacob Wheeler, still looking for his first scorable bass of Red Crest 2023. He's been third place each of the last two years in Redcrest. Big spot. Take your time, fish. Taking your time. It's like my eyes are gone. Solid spot of back right there. Let me go ahead and pop the hook out real quick. He wasn't coming off. He hit on the fall, I didn't had no clue. Let me grab. Mm -mm -mm. Come here, buddy. I'm just trying to get it. Can't get the bait. If I can get the bait out of the way, I can see a little bit. Oh, there it is, okay. Got him. Solid one. There, not a fat, I thought he was real fat. That's a, I mean, that's a solid fish, though. Two pounds, 12 ounces. A two 12 spotted bass, starts morning off. I'm not complaining, trust me. Those are the kind you need. Two 12s are good ones. Two twelves are good ones. Solid one to get Wheeler's Day start. So Mark Davis has four for 10 pounds, eight ounces, including that 412. And we get back out to Jacob Wheeler. Game changers right there. Watching Wheeler and seeing where he's at, I think and I'm looking at Connell and our score tracker too. I, I'm not going to say the demise of forward-facing sonar this week, 
but in our off camera or off screens, we were watching Jacob offshore a bunch first thing this morning. Is that why you've been smiling all morning, no. Marty? Uh, look, since he won that event you fall in 2020, and the whole world thinks you have to have forward-facing sonar, out of 25 events, 10 of them have been won with forward-facing sonar or some type of combo. The other 15 have not. Hey, we, we heard it right here from one of the greatest of all time, Andy Morgan, who gave us the quote, if you ain't scoping, you're hoping. Yeah, but 10 out of 25 Man, events is not the demise one. of regular fishing. It's a little chunky, yeah, it is. Your math's wrong. <laughs> Oh, He's not one real time big, you want a math check me. He's a healthy one. <laughs> Come here. Okay. I'll take you right there. Another solid. I mean, not a great, but anything over two pounds solid. One pound, 12 one ounces. One 12 pound, great quarter. All right. All right. Started slow. Now I'm starting to pick it up a little bit. So that's a 112 and a 212 for Wheeler. He's at four and a half pounds for his I'm two fish today. Heck, they're gonna bite. bite. Big in. Come on. Yes, sir. Got him. Solid spot. There you go. Another big, nice spot. That's what we're talking about right there. Solid spotted bass, man. Three pounds even. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> yeah, man. Three pounds spot. Those are two solid ones for the day. That's exactly what you need to do. Get a good couple of really nice bites and look at that fish. I mean, just beautiful. It's actually just a post spawn fish. He's probably like 19 and a half inches long. That's what Lake Norman, those, those spots are growing up. See you later, buddy. Thanks a lot for the bite. God! See, I'm okay with that. Oh, smokes. Okay. Problem is, all right. That was, that was a, that was fun. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> okay. Down and take my time right here, get, Take a little bit of time to get my stuff together now. I want to make another cast. I'm like, ooh, okay. That's what's up right there. It's like, you hooked that sucker. You're like, they all have so much fun. <laughs> I love it, man. I can't get out. I, I do love that. It just, it's harder to beat. So I'm like, I saw that sucker sitting on a pole and I'm like, please just go down there and bite it. I know you're a big one. It's like, Dude. I knew I was like, oh. Dang, man. We got. We got. All right, those are better ones anyway. Doing a little better than the first thing this morning. Dustin's increased his lead. He has 13 pounds, 3 ounces in first place. I'm gonna come back there to the U. Stripping a little drag. Ooh, 
Wheeler is certainly doing what he's set out to do. He's not catching nearly as many fish as these other guys, but when he sets up, it's a good one. Beautiful spot, dude. Come here. Boom, baby. Yes, sir. Look at that. Brand new red line, just in the dang snod, snout right there. That's a freaking good one. So BMC just came out with a new red line Nico, and that's TPF even medium steel. That's a dang good spot right there. Three pounds, one ounce. <laughs> Another three pounder. Okay, okay. All right, all right. One at a time. One at a time. I'm let this guy go. See you later, buddy. All right, let's keep riding, keep going. Three pounder. Back over to Wheeler, already hooked up. I got hooked weird. Ooh, you smoked, I didn't know how big it was. What's Another good one. Holy yeah. moly. <laughs> I didn't know how big it was. <laughs> With both flips that I didn't know. That right there is, a, is actually a new I can't tell you guys about it, but I'm gonna give you guys a sneak peek. It's a new Rappler jerk bait that is just coming out. So I'm fortunate to have very, one of the very few. Oh, that dude right there is a bad dude. And he tricked that one. That's a big old spot. Three pounds, four ounces. Okay. So he wasn't as big as that. He's three and a quarter. He's a beautiful spot of bass. That's a beautiful spot. Like, look at that thing. Just the markings on him. Gosh, it's just a pretty fish. All right, buddy. Thank you so much. Go ahead out there. See you later. All right, let's keep moving. Third fish keep for Wheeler today, over three pounds. Three even, keep three one, and three four. <laughs> that was a dang. I, I was shocked on that one. I thought I, I hooked one. I, I was turning the turkey bait, locked up. And I'm like, oh, there's a good one. And I'm like, ah, oh, it's not fine. That good. You can see it in the clear water. Then it was a good fish, but I was like, ah, pound and three quarter. But hopefully, but about when I got it about over the gun one, I'm like, oh, snap. Like, that's a big, <laughs> that's awesome. All right, let's keep running around. Listen, I don't know if we'll be on that or not, but we're gonna make a cast right there. Solid period. Solid period. Caught us some nice fish and we're on our way to be in a good position. So we're just gonna re a couple more rods and come up with a game plan for, for this third period. Take these bibs off, man. We got, uh, hey, it's, it's starting to warm up a little bit. Now, now Chad, he's been warm all day. <laughs> but no, nah, we're gonna have some fun. Gonna... All right, y'all, so this is what's up. We've had a pretty good period. Um, caught two good ones. One sort of random one. I sort of knew there were some fish there. I was able to catch a good three-pounder. Um, found a couple other places that were just okay, you know, but, but we're going to run around like a lot, a lot this last period. So we're in a good position. We have a full period of practice. I'm going to run around like crazy, man. Trust me, we're going to run like crazy, man. <laughs> so hold on to your hat. We're going to try to reel a couple of bass. I'm going to put this chesty away, put the jersey on, and uh, see if we can't reel one more in. You know what I'm saying? Just one more. Go get him. <laughs> uh, I gotta get in the boat with you. I know, man. I was gonna say, I, you had not been here. I've like, been hey. over here for like this, starting your three. I know, I'm like, dude, I haven't even been in the boat, EK. <laughs> and we transfer. Listen, so, EK, man, we've been, we've been, we go way back, way back. Back to Cherokee, 
when we dropped the bag on him the final day and he started he said man he said drop him he said you got a sunday a sunday mcflurry yeah I said, you, ser you serving up more flurries on <laughs> sunday than mcdonald's <laughs> that's what he said <laughs> He said Sunday. He said I served up one. They were asking me if it, they were saying, "Is the score right?" And I was like, "Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, it is." That That's... just happened. <laughs> it was pretty good, man. Going back there. I know. We're gonna go reel some more in here in a few weeks. So you had to do it from uh, somebody else's boat last. Time. I know. <laughs> I can't believe it. It's crazy how everything's been from that. Uh, it's unbelievable. But that was the fucking new rule. All right, end of a solid day out there on Norman. Definitely not what i expected in a good way so i uh, was able to reel in 15 pounds of spots which only has me in fourth place but the smallest one was 212 i think because one was like three four or something like that that's i mean it was it was pretty solid to be honest with you i was i was very excited to reel them by saying holy smokes we got an angle we got an angle holy moly Okay, Dustin at 16.7. Wow. 15.11, 15 15.6, 15.3, 14.15, 15 uh, 15 Cody Meyer. Ooh. Matt Lee, 14.4, Thrift, 13.12. Jeez, stomped him. My big fish was 3.4. Dang. All right, all right. We got we to gotta step it on up. Jeez. Mark had 12.7. 13 pounds is ninth. So it's going to take, I think it's going to take 11 and a half. 20, uh, 23 pounds. That's what I'm going to take. It's going to be 8 pounds tomorrow. That's what I'm guessing. 8. I'm, I'm, I'm going to shoot for 10. And then we're going to sort of see what's going on. I, I want to go snatch a couple of them. I've got to figure out how we're going to go about this one. Damn, they got, it was close at 11. But I hate what? it because it shows up in my mouth. I don't have no bats. Alright, so it's morning of day two. Got everything locked and loaded in the boat. Getting ready to get to the ramp, and man, it's uh, thinking about it, man. It's 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 definitely uh, you could definitely tell it's a championship event. You know, you're obviously focused. Um, went to dinner with the boys last night, Mark and, and, and Adrian. We all went out, and, and we got a little surprise though, because you know it's a championship event. We gotta have a little fun, and so I have a little surprise for DC this morning. DC got a real quiet last night. Didn't hear from him. I said, Hey, you gotta pay up on your bed, free dog. <laughs> All right, first things first, guys. We got something special for this dude right here. This guy's name, Blanks. Hey, Blanks needs to dang your eye, big dog. He's gonna be a real good co angler. They got to get the monkey off his back. He's the low guy on the totem pole. Oh. Sorry, I got a five minute penalty off the rip throwing dang monkeys. You gotta wear it like that. All right, so huh? some things, you just gotta, you gotta, oh, here you go, hold up. Hey, right, put that in the back right there. He's part of, he's, he, yes, he is a bay he made, he's gotta take it. I'm gonna get in huge trouble. Don't say nothing. I'll, I'll say I did it, trust me, promise. We I won't. on video. We don't, it's okay. Literally, it was, it's on the, the group, literally. <laughs> Tell him about the end of the first period when he makes the cut. Hey, and he might the best of it. But yeah, well, well, the next part you'll see is I just can't do both of them at the same time. So just put that back there, you're fine. Yes, and say, dude, see, Jimmy Ding's not bad luck. <laughs> see? That's how you do it, because it's all mental doing. There you go. That is it settles. We're good. So after three four we'll com competition. Once well, they hit lines out, you're gonna be in that top 20, 20, so we're gonna see. He, he, I, I don't even know. I'm like, look, you just gotta catch a fish with it on. Just one fish. That's it. Catch your doinker. I don't care. Just you catch one bet. You catch if one's blowing up and you're freaking ain't one fish out there. You got a camera. I need you to set the hook and like catch a one with it, <laughs> like a like a magnum hook set. People, there's about 
23, 24,000 people that will lose their mind oh. when they see it because they'll know what happened. Yes. Like, I've already posted our travel vlog with old buddy in it. Like, yeah. Talking about it. Yeah. They're going to lose their mind. Yeah, they're going to be like, Ping Tutu. You did it, right? <laughs> oh my God. All right. all right, so this is all you got to do. This is all you got to do. It's real simple. Okay, we were at dinner last night. All, all, the whole crew, the whole crew decided. All you have to do. Oh, my God. Paint Tutu. Oh, you just put him on. Okay, this is the thing. Okay. First cast? No, you got to catch one fish on him. No. <laughs> yes. You gotta catch, I got to make it, it, it does not have to be a big one. It doesn't have to be a scoreboard, but you have to catch one fish with a Tutu on, and then you can take him off. Sounds good. That's it. That's the deal of the day. The deal of the day. They got to be boys. Here you go. I'm not putting. Yeah, him you got to put him on. on. No, no way. And take I'll, off. I'll slide him on when I get in the boat. <laughs> slide yeah, him on. I'll just... run to my first spot with him on. <laughs> do I'll it. Do it. You got to do, do it. You got to run. You got to start. It starts when you jump in your boat. Hey, Liz. How are you, my girl? Good. Hey. Hey, How are you? You made it to take off, huh? Made it to the fishing tournament. That's it. Okay, I love you. Okay, I gotta go. We'll go walk down to Daddy's boat. Okay. I will walk it down. I'm not. Jasper Tran. Tell the camera. What do you need Daddy to do? In boat for 15. He sits in 19, 11 pounds, Just a little fishy. Mercury. Phoenix, Claire Logistic Packing for the Rooster! Big fishy! Okay, Levy! In boat number 16, it's a former Bassmaster Big Fishy champion. Sitting in 37, 8 pounds for day number 1. Look at this. Seven ounces. Seven ounces. Oh, and he's just fat, healthy little chunky right there. A little chunky spot to start the morning off. All right. Two pounds, two ounces. There we go. There we go. Solid spot to start the morning. That is not the biggest one, but we will definitely take that one. Should have more come out if there was more there though. Okay, let's roll. You're fine, we're not going far. Thank you. I'm a little shaky head action. All right. Two pounds, one ounce. Two pounders today. Well, we got a few of them, so it's all right. All right. It's not bad.
That's got to be a keeper right there. That one's horrible. One pound, 13 ounces. All right, there you go. More like it. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, Asher did caught three. I'm like, how in the world are they that dang fickle? Okay. 25, zero ounces. Doing big dog. Come here. I mean, you're gonna help a little bit. All right. Amazing. A little bit. Two pounds. One ounce. There you go. All right. Look at that thing. They're eating, look at how that, they, they're eating like the owl. I think they're just shad mostly, but that might be a, I'm not exactly sure, it looks like they're eating crappie. Them spots are mean. They don't, they don't care. All right, let's keep moving. Well, I'm gonna stop, let me just look and see if there's something more. Huh. Good job, Daddy. All right, thanks for holding on one second. All right, y'all, we are in the lead right now. So we've solidified our spot into the top 20. It's time to shake fish off, so I'm going to put the chesty off. I'm going to go run around. You guys know the game, so I might even, uh, I might keep it on. We'll sort of see what happens. we got a break right now, so I just want to give you guys a heads up. That's sort of what's going down. On to the next round. Officially made it through. Now it's just a. The real tournament starts tomorrow. Weights will zero, and uh, so yeah, it's time to to go run around and see what we can catch. I feel like uh, we're gonna get quite a few bites. I just don't know exactly, um, you know, how big they're gonna be, and that's gonna be the determiner if we if we do well or not <laughs> so wish us luck i'm about to call it a night put this guy right here go out there and uh give her hell that's the plan we do have uh we do have blanks tomorrow though so good we, luck today for eight. he was good luck for a, a, a squared so that might be a good sign. I might be begging for it for, for blanks. <laughs> we'll see.